I think that's it, guys. Uh, hard shifting, banging in and out of gear, and sometimes it will not crank. Let's first try to duplicate this stuff, man. Oh, no sense trying to diagnose anything without being able to duplicate it. All right, now here we go. Yep, started right up. I hate when that happens. I want to see. Now the check engine light is on. Ooh, and the ABS light is on. Let me try it again. Uh-oh. Y'all saw that? I'm still in the start position. Let me let it go. All right. Let me try it again. Man. Let it go. Whoa. Y'all hear that? It just... Uh-oh. Ooh, delay and everything. Y'all see that delay? I don't know if y'all can hear the, uh, how the audio coming off in y'all ear. This stupid bell. Let me see something. Let me wait till the bell stop. All right. Here we go. Damn. Wait till the bell stop. And then we're going to... We're getting a delay crank and we're going to know... We're getting a crank, but it's a crunk. Hey, here we go. So if I go straight after, just turn, see like that. I'm still in crank position. Now I'm letting it go. But if I come straight from the start, wow, y'all see that? I can duplicate it. Okay. I'm still in crank. Look at that. I'm holding the key. Now I'm letting it go. But if I leave it and run... Wait till the bell shut up and then try to crank it. It cranks. Yeah, so that's not a starter. We're losing something in between the transmission and the... Uh, this is a tip on this car and a PCM. We're losing something, guys. We have to scan this thing. Oh, buddy. Okay, at least I got a chance to duplicate it, guys. Let's go. Whoa! Y'all hear that? Ooh. Whoa! I am banging, going from reverse to drive. Here we go. Y'all see how much I'm shaking? Okay, I'm in neutral and go to drive. Go! A harsh engagement, guys. All right, guys, we got to get this thing in the shop and uh, possibly get it scanned. Let's get it. We're going to do some troubleshooting, guys. I'm going to take y'all along with me. All right. So stay tuned. I'm heading to the shop. We're going to scan this thing. All right, guys. So it's, whoa, it's bumping in and out of gear. I'm in the shop now. So I'm going to see if it does it again. Let's t let's take a look. All right. Turn it off. Turn it back on. Ooh, a delay. Okay, let's see. Y'all heard that? So the when I turn the key to the start position, I just get a curt. Let's do it again. Take a listen. Okay, it started that time. Let's see now. Did that time. Let's do it again. That's a delay in the starting. But my problem, well, my thing is that uh, that click right there. See, I'm all the way in the start position. And I got a click. Like the starter tried to start. I'm going to let it go. We'll turn it back off see what happens. Oh, man, guys. Now, we do have problems. This is a 06, I think. Out of the newer ones, the 08, we had a problem with start-run relay or run-start relay causing a delay in cranking. But I got, man, that's the delay. I got cold. I got lights on. Y'all see the check engine light. Good to check in the light on because that means I will have a fault code. Y'all see ABS and traction control and stuff like that on. So what we're going to do, guys, well, we have no choice. Look at that. We're going to the computer. Now, I don't know. This is 06 code, so it can go either way as far as transmission. If it have a NAG transmission or the 42 RLE. I'm not sure because there's no way I can know that without either looking or looking at the scan tool. So... But if this is a transmission-related problem, because I'm bumping in and out of gear, guys, as if 
the transmission don't have a clue what gear I'm in. I got a real hard bump in and out of gear. So what I need to do, I tell you what, guys, let's let me try this one more time. Then we go into the computer. Look at that long delay, guys. Let's go to the computer. I'm gonna leave it on. Hook my scan tool up. All right, let's head over to the computer. All right, guys, here we are. Wow, we got a lot of yellow boxes, and you know yellow indicates um, colds in East Br Why is this WCM keep coming in and out? Y'all saw that? All right, let's go to all DTCs. Ooh, whoa, whoa. The tip on front control module, you. Y'all know what you mean. That's communication, lost communication with TCM, uh-oh. Okay, let's ignore this high vet code. It's TCM, uh-oh. Internal control module ROM, guys. This car has to have a NAG transmission in it. And the ABS is on because of lost communication with TCM. The PCM, which is the reason the check engine light on, has the same U code. So, guys, we get no signal from the TCM. That very well could be causing everything. So let's go straight into the TCM module and take a look at some things okay yes 0605 internal control module ROM guys when you see that it's pretty you're not left with many options in fact let's go take a look at the diagnostics wow p0605 Ooh, that we're looking like uh it's not a 42 rle this is a nag transmission okay based on the fact that i had a tcm box all right, according to this diagnostic tree, I'm supposed to uh, run all this test, but there's not much you can run. Look at the possible cause, guys. Transmission control module. There's nothing I can do. Okay, the mere fact that the code set uh, means I have power supply and ground going to it. Here's the transmission module right here. This is where I get my power source. And I'm sure the bottom one is where I get my ground. So that has to be there for that cold to even set. So no need checking that because I'm obviously getting power to there. But I will check it just just for the fun of it. You know, but yeah, the only possible cause for this cold is a transmission module. Wow. Now with this being a nag transmission, that is a separate module that's housed under the steering column, guys. Always remember that on nag transmission. NAG1, pretty much we're done with the NAG transmission. That was only a five-speed transmission. But, yeah, that is this is why PCM, the check-in the line, is on because I'm getting no communication from the TCM, and that's active, meaning it sees that now. Wow. Okay, guys, all I can do, I mean, I, I don't want, want y'all to get some out of this video. If nothing else, we was able to duplicate the problem. We, it's active, guys, so the computer's seeing this stuff now. Internal control module ROM, P0605. Ladies and gentlemen, I need right here. This is the diagnostics. Check fuse 37. Possible cause. There's nothing else, according to FCA, there's nothing else that will cause this code but this. Okay, let's go back to the car. All right, guys, I have the car running. Uh, hey, 3.5, guys. 3.5. Yep. You can look down there. It's a nag transmission. Remember what I told y'all about the controller? I feel an open slot, which is where a TCM connector would go if this wasn't a nag. So, um, I have a problem with the TCM, guys. So we will, I will have to order a TCM and I'm gonna replace the run start relay also. But for the most part, I have to order TCM. There's nothing else I can do. I'm gonna check the fluid and likely sell a transmission service just to help prolong the life of the transmission. Now the computer didn't pick up any internal failures of the transmission. Just the mere fact that the electronic portion of the transmission have problems okay that's what's likely causing that delay shift and that bumping in in and out of gear it's bumping in and out of gear all right guys so that's all i have man thanks for watching comment subscribe i'll see y'all in the next video